it only takes a few rotating veins to pull liquid in and push it back out. That mechanism is called a vein pump. No gears, no screws, just sliding veins. So how does it actually create suction? Inside the pump, a slotted rotor spins slightly off-center inside the housing. Several small veins fit into the rotor slots. As the rotor turns, the veins slide in and out, always staying in contact with the inner wall. On the inlet side, the space between veins increases, creating suction that pulls liquid in. As the rotor moves toward the outlet, that space gets smaller and smaller, so the fluid is compressed and forced out. This means the pump is always sucking on one side and pushing on the other. Compared to a gear pump, a vein pump runs smoother and handles low viscosity fluids better. That's why it's widely used for fuel, solvents, and other thin liquids. Simple design, stable flow, reliable performance. So tell me, would you choose a vein pump over a gear pump?